Stair railings can be offset from the stairs using the Offset Railings feature. These tools will allow you to create any number of stair railing styles to match the needs of your clients. In this example I've created, I want to move my railing so it attaches to the side of the stairs instead of the top of the treads. To do this, I'll open the stairs for specification and go to the railing panel. Here I can change the horizontal offset to be whatever I want it to be. If I want to move the railing closer to the middle of the stairs, I would give the offset a positive value. If I want to move the railing farther from the middle of the stair, I would give the offset a negative value. Since I want to move my railing to attach to the side of the stairs, I'll set a negative horizontal offset of negative 1.5 inches. Then, on the Newels and Balusters panel, I'll set the bottom offset to negative 4 inches. Notice the clipped check mark to the right. If I want my Newell post to stop at the floor platform of the room, I'll leave the clipped check mark checked. If I want my Newell post to extend below the floor platform, I would uncheck the clipped check box. In this case, I want my Newell post to stop at the floor platform, so I'll leave it checked and click OK. This method will allow you to offset the entire railing as well as lower the Newell post below the tops of the treads. But what if I want to have just my balusters offset but have my cables run along the inside of the railing? I can do this by opening the stairs for specification again and going to the railings panel. Since I want my cables to be over the treads again, I'll set the horizontal offset back to 0 inches. Next, on the Newels and Balusters panel, I have the option to set a horizontal offset for just the Newels. I'll change that to the same offset we had on the railing panel, negative 1.5 inches. If I click OK, Chief will offset the Newels and put the cables back on top of the treads. But you'll notice the top railing is over the cables and not resting on the Newel posts. To change this, I'll open the stairs for specification and go to the Rails panel. On the Rails panel, I can set an offset for the individual rails on the railings. In this case, since I have just the top rail, I can adjust the top rail horizontal offset to negative 1.5 inches to match the offset of my newels. I'll click OK, and now my top rail is building on top of the newels correctly.